SciWorld Hangul, SciWorldu is a South Korean social network service. SciWorld became an independent company, came out of the SK Communication in 2014. Members cultivate relationships by forming Ilchen Hangul, Ilchen Hanya, Yikun or friendships with each other through their mini hompi avatars and mini rooms. Small, decoratable, apartment-like spaces in an isometric projection are features of the service, which can make for a Sims-like experience. The Psy in Psy World can mean cyber, but is also a pun on the Korean word for relationship, Hangul, Psy between. Psy World is a rough equivalent to MySpace of the United States, with the main difference being that revenue is generated through the sale of dotori, Hangul, dotoli or acorns, which can be used to purchase virtual goods, such as background music, pixelated furniture, and virtual appliances. Psy World also has operations in China and Vietnam. History <inaudible> <inaudible> Overview SciWorld launched in 1999 and was purchased by SK Communications in 2003. It became one of the first companies to profit from the sale of virtual goods. SciWorld was wildly popular in its home market, with 2005 claims that practically every South Korean in their 20s and 25% of the South Korean population were users. By 2006, its domestic user base numbered 19 million, but this dropped to 18 million by 2008. SciWorld's reception in some overseas markets did not prove as enthusiastic, and by 2010, SciWorld had ended its operations in Germany, Japan, and the United States. As of 2009, it continues to provide service to the Chinese and Vietnamese markets where it has subscriber bases of 7 million and 450,000, respectively. <laughs> <laughs> Initial stages The idea for SciWorld started in August 1999 by KAIST student organization the EC Club, a club that took on online business projects. The club members got the idea to create a social networking website while discussing topics for a research project. Though most club members abandoned the project after graduation, Dong Hyung Lee remained to pursue the project, taking the role of CEO from December 1999. The word sai is a Korean word meaning between people, underlining the networking aspect of the website and connoting a close relation between the website users. However, most misinterpret sai as an abbreviation for cyber due to its fortis. Sai corresponds to a more accurate pronunciation of a Korean word for between. The original nature of the term sai demonstrates Dong Hyung Lee's vision for the site. He wanted to create an internet community that allowed people to form close relationships, rather than a community where people merely sought information for business prospects. SciWorld at its early stages was quite different from that of today. It was a website that showed a list of members from the same hometown or school. The address book for each member was updated automatically according to the personal information its members provided. It was not a place where people could express themselves, but rather a website that allowed people to gain means of contact, so that members could meet offline. SciWorld at its early stages was far from successful, once running a deficit of 1.5 billion won. Mini Homepy In the summer of 2002, SciWorld launched the Mini Homepy project, a last chance to turn things around before the business had to shut down. CEO Dong Hyung Lee put contents provider Ram Lee in charge of the project. It was an instant success, offering many methods of expressing oneself. The mini homepy had features such as a main picture, history, user profile, photo story, story room, background music, photo album, diary, bulletin board, video clips, and decorating links. Another component of the mini homepy was the Miniroom, a decorative online room furnished with virtual furniture. 
One of the main reasons for Mini Homepage's success was people's dissatisfaction with the individual homepages that were prevalent in Korea at the time. While individual homepages were initially widely popular because they enabled people to express themselves online, the programming knowledge e HTML, FTP, required to create an individual homepage was too daunting for most people. Although knowledge barrier was partially resolved through homepage programming services such as Hi Home, Hangul, Hi Home, there still remained a significant issue. The means of communication between individual homepage users was absent. Individual homepages were like stranded islands in the vast sea called the Internet. Mini Homepage addressed the desire for interpersonal communication. Mini Homepages were easy to create and maintain. Mini Homepages had components like visitor logs and comments, which provided a means of contact, while features such as the diary and bulletin boards allowed for individual expression. It was amicably received by the public. Members had to become Ilchens in order to gain access to each other's mini homepies. The mini homepie service was officially launched on September 9, 2002. SciWorld uses its own form of cybermoney, called Dotori Acorns. The items for decorating the mini homepies and mini rooms could be bought with Dotoris, and people voluntarily spent money on Dotori as their mini homepie decoration was perceived as another expression of themselves. SciWorld gained further success when, in November 2002, its competitor Freechal, another networking site for online communities, decided to charge its users 3,000 won per month. Freechal also announced plans to shut down communities operated by those who failed to pay the fee. This pay or shut down policy prompted a horde of members to cancel their subscriptions and move to other free online community hosts, including SciWorld. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Merger with SK Telecom. In August 2003, SciWorld merged with SK Telecom, a Korean communication company and owner of the domain Nate. The rapidly increasing number of subscribers was getting too difficult for SciWorld to manage on its own, and SK promised resources for further growth in the market. Although it was incorporated into the SK community department, SciWorld retained its brand name, service, and independence. The CEO of SciWorld Dong Hyung Lee was appointed as the general manager of the SciWorld department, and he moved on to be the CEO of SciWorld Japan in May 2005 until he left the company in December 2008 to pursue other business adventures. The merger immediately led to significant market success. By the end of 2003, SciWorld gave rise to the terms, Sciholic, a SciWorld addict, and Sigil. Jill is a Korean pun for action, so Sigil means doing SciWorld related activities. SciWorld became a sensation among the Korean public, more than tripling in monthly visitors from 2 million to 7 million from early 2003 to November 2003. SciWorld's success grew even further when it began to collaborate with Nateon, the largest online messenger service in Korea and also owned by SK. The collaboration was established in 2005, allowing SciWorld and Nate on members to use both services simultaneously by logging into just one site. In early 2007, SciWorld topped 20 million members for its services, roughly half the population of South Korea, giving rise to the term SHON era, meaning any two SciWorld members are likely to be SciWorld Ilchins through fewer than four connections. In 2009, SciWorld unified its domain with SK's Nate. This move was meant for user convenience, as the two domains had over 17 million overlapping members. No significant change was made to the site after the union. As of 2011, SciWorld had over 25 million members. Topic: 2011 data leakage and decline. As Facebook began its services in Korea in 2009, SciWorld slowly began to lose its status as the only popular SNS service in Korea. According to some research, Facebook's simpler design and function were more appealing and easier to use than SciWorld. 
As SciWorld did not offer global services, it was an undesirable service for people who wanted to contact friends around the world. The introduction of smartphones to the market was also a key factor in SciWorld's decline, as both Facebook and Twitter offered stronger interconnectivity with mobile platforms. Kakao Story, an SMS service exclusive for smartphone users, had an advantage over its rivals due to its connection with mobile service KakaoTalk Kakaotalk which has over 55 million members. SciWorld's inability to keep up with the trend made it fall behind in the market. SciWorld's declining market share was further aggravated by a 2011 data leakage. In July 2011, SciWorld, Nate was hacked into by criminals who stole the personal information of more than 35 million users. Nate had 33 million users and SciWorld had 25 million, and combined, they had about 35 million members. The information for almost all of the SciWorld, Nate members, and by extension about 70% of the Korean population, was compromised. The hackers accessed SciWorld's system by using an Internet Protocol address based in China. Because SciWorld, Nate requires its members to submit personal information for membership, the 2011 data leakage was quite detrimental as the hackers had the members' resident registration numbers, phone numbers, and email addresses. Though SK Communications insisted that the resident registration numbers and passwords were encrypted and are not likely to be abused even in the hands of the hackers, nobody gave the company the benefit of the doubt. SK Telecom took measures trying to minimize the harm, but it was soon flooded with lawsuits demanding compensation for the leakage. The leakage yielded costly lawsuits for the company, in a country with virtually no precedent in class action lawsuits. The public's discontent with the data leak led straight to the plummet of stock prices. The company's reputation was tarnished and information-sensitive Koreans moved to other SNS service after the leakage. This phenomenon was directly reflected in the plunging page views for SciWorld, Nate. Between March 2011 and April 2012, the monthly UV unique visitors and PV page view for SciWorld dropped from 21.5 million and 7.5 billion to 16.5 million and 1.7 billion, respectively. Statistics show that the fall in UV and PV became more dramatic after the July 2011 data leakage. In September 2012, SK Telecom announced its decision to allow membership for SciWorld without obligating members to register resident registration numbers and real names. A minimum amount of personal information, such as email address and nationality, would be asked of future members. Topic. Foreign market After its domestic success SciWorld began to venture into foreign markets. In 2005, it started services in China and subsequently entered the Japan and Vietnam markets. SciWorld lost out to Japan's Mixi and exited the Japanese market in August 2008. As of 2009, its operations in China and Vietnam were more optimistic. It had 7 million and 450,000 members, respectively. SciWorld entered the U.S. market in 2006, believing that many U.S. teenagers would use multiple social networks and seeking early access to a then quickly growing market. However, it lost market share to Facebook and exited the U.S. market in February 2010. In 2006, SciWorld entered a joint venture with a German Deutsche Telekom subsidiary, T Online, and launched its European version a year later. Strong competition from sites like Studies and Skyrock, as well as a saturated market made for dismal future prospects, and by 2008, SciWorld had closed operations. Topic. Renovation SciWorld concluded to end its Mini Hompi service on September 31, 2015, and it will renovate to a new platform named SciHome. These days, SciWorld's social network service is ready for a massive update and service activation with diverse marketing campaign. SciWorld Corporation is also going for a next stage which is to open new service. It is called QApp service. It is news curation service which is able to optimize recommendation. 
Topic Website Topic Ilchin Ilchin is originally a Korean word that denotes very close familial relations, such as between a parent and a child. Becoming Ilchin is how users in SciWorld begin their interaction. The user sends an Ilchin request for another user to receive. If the request is accepted, the Ilchins can see the content of each other's mini homepi that are not made available to those who are not Ilchins, such as the diary and photo sections. One can also assign an interest ilchin to some of their friends. If interest ilchin is assigned, the user is notified when the interest ilchin's homepage is updated. Users can also see their friends' online statuses. Until Twitter and Facebook came out, the ilchon system was one of the most popular online social networking tools in Korea. Topic: <laughs> Dotori SciWorld uses its own virtual currency called Dotori Hangul, Dotoli or Acorns. Dong Hyung Lee coined the term in 2002. One Dotori costs 100 won, and they are used to purchase virtual goods. Prices vary from about 2 acorns for a wall painting or 6 acorns for a song that plays in your room to 40 acorns for a homepage background for your for that last for a year. Most items purchased with Dotori have a time limit. Dotori can be given to Ilchins, and is often given to friends as birthday presents. As the currency unit for SciWorld, Dotori is the main source of revenue for the company. In 2006, 80% of SciWorld's Korean income was generated from the sale of virtual goods. Clink service has been launched in 2018 for further development of digital currency ecosystem. Clink has replaced Dotori as Podo during its service. Clink has also shown coconut as currency. Mini Homepi Mini Homepi is essentially a cyberspace allotted to each SciWorld member. Using Dotori, users can decorate their Mini Homepies as they see fit. Mini Homepi features include the main background, history, profile, photo story, story room, background music, photo album, diary, and bulletin board, allowing for self-expression. The Mini Room is a virtual room with a Minimi avatar, a self-representational space that the users can decorate with virtual items purchased with their Dotori. Dotori can be used to buy new background skins, Minirum interiors, background music, banners, and fonts. There are also other special features, such as Ilchin Padatagi, which are links for surfing the mini hompies of fellow Ilchins, and Random Padatagi, links for surfing the mini hompies of strangers. <laughs> Club Clubs are online communities for SciWorld Mini Homepi users. Like in the Mini Homepi, Dotori can be used to decorate the clubs. It is not very different from other online clubs in other websites. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Blog. The SciWorld blog is not unlike blogs in other websites. Dotori is used for decorating users' blogs. SciWorld blogs permit anyone to access its contents, but the user can make it function as another version of Mini Homepi and allow it only viewable by Ilchins. Wizays, photo logs, and bulletin boards are features of the blog. SciWorld blogs also link with Natian. <laughs> Natian SciWorld collaborates with Natian Hangul, Naitu on a widely used instant messenger service in Korea. If SciWorld users buy fonts with Dotori in SciWorld, they can use those fonts with Natian, too. Q Daily News Briefing Service Application Impact 
SciWorld has exerted significant influence on Korea's Internet culture. The popular use of the term, Sciholic, is indicative of this. Self expression is a desire that SciWorld can satisfy. SciWorld has provided a cyber space where users can readily express their feelings to Ilchens. It also allows the viewer of another person's mini homepage to get satisfaction from learning about the other person's life. However, uploaded materials and diaries tend to be somewhat dissembling, if not pretentious, for the sake of gaining sympathy from other users. Mini Hompies succeeded in functioning as social platforms through which users could express their personal traits and private thoughts. Another unique feature of SciWorld is the tracker displayed on the upper left hand side of the Mini Hompie. It shows two numbers, called today the number of visitors to the Mini Hompie on that day and total the total number of visitors to the Mini Hompie. If the number of visitors is high, the visitor assumes the owner of the Mini Homepage is popular. Indeed, what's his today? was a popular phrase among SciWorld users as it was taken by many to be a sign of popularity. Online tools that manipulated such indicators of popularity were also produced, for instance, one service offered to increase the customer's today total by 20 a day. Celebrity diaries were vastly popular, bringing about thousands of comments with each entry. Mini homepies began to function as an official way to learn about the celebrity's life, but celebrities often controlled their public images through their mini homepies. Celebrities have also employed mini homepies as a marketing strategy, using them to enhance their image or to advertise programs that they are in. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Award In 2006, SciWorld received the Wharton Infosys Business Transformation Award for being an organization that has made the best use of IT for transformation. See also SciWorld Digital Music Awards Q Cryptocurrency MySpace <laughs>